Now, with our new hero, the Rabbit Avenger, we have stalled the Thrix Zone. We shall secure this time. We're going to take an item, too. I feel lucky. Meanwhile, our other guy is busy building out those sight thingies for me. There you go. Got the lumber yard. Got hot wood, spell threads. Oh, accuracy. Sweet. 104, 108. Thodian needs to. Starting to get really good at this. Scout it out. Man, I love this game. It's just so much fun. The Leaping Pines Forest was revealed. The Thrixo shouldn't be too much further ahead of us. I could have sworn they went this way. They did. Look, behind these rocks. Holes in the ground? I don't want to climb in a hole. Tunnels buried deep into the earth. I say we get in there. We can't let them get away. Yeah, this is a much higher percentage of chance. Watch this fail now. Hurry, who knows when they'll get back? This is a cowardly way to engage over. Who cares? You know, every even Raglan the Ranger was known to set traps for his enemy, and he still remembered as one of the greatest heroes that ever lived. I, you're right. Let's get started. Working together, they fashion a trap from nearby saplings. Now we cover it with fallen leaves. I hear something. Everyone, hide. They quickly duck behind the rocks, the sounds of chittering growing ever louder. The insectoid creatures emerge from the earth, spindly legs carrying them into the sunlight. And then, sprung! It worked! Yes, but it won't hold them for long. We have the advantage. Attack! I suppose we'll suffer two damage to start the mission. There's a lot of... How are they in a tower all of a sudden? Oh my god, I have an Avenger bunny. I'm gonna go ahead and guardian it up. Thodian, open the door, my friend. Thodian? What? the hell? I must have accidentally hit weight or something stupid. I don't know. Can I lure dump him? Yeah! Stunned for two turns, baby. God, I love it so much. So he's stunned for the rest of this turn. You're gonna have to come get me. Ooh, like an infernal rain. What's that? That's amazing. Go Lord dump him again. Yeah. Oh my God! Yes. George, Winter, Bush. I don't know why. I was watching Scary Game Squad. Constrict, Splinter, Blast, 
Shock trap. That's interesting. For some reason I can only shoot him, but that's okay. Thoden, you need to get your butt up there. And Lavidia, you need to get your butt up there. Nope. Ouch. Oh, he shredded some armor. Oh, that's... Ha! <laughs> oh, each one, each square is an individual pin instead of like, uh... With the uh, jump trap where it only hits one person. That's cool. Go, Avenger Bunny! And move in and out of the way and just... There you go. Lover's Vengeance! Yeah, ooh. Uh, but they both already have humble guineas, so I don't want to. Just go to take the fabric so I can make something better. I still feel like the big expensive weapons and armor that you can find should. Uh, oh, I cleared all that too. Sweet. Thirty-nine townsfolk will survive. Though, so the people, the number of people keeps going up and down. So I don't know. Burn what's not useful. Uh, quarry. Yeah, a quarry. It's gonna take a legacy point, but we have lots of legacy points, so I'm not worried about it. Yay! Yay! Just have them get over here. Oh, they're about to, uh... But I'm... Incursion, yeah. They're on attacking the town of Mordor. Oh! Well, let's just uh, attack now. Yeah! Buried beneath Southbrush trunks is a thing the Mothman called a glimmer scene. Here's another moth. A glimmer scene is a physical space where this world remains stitched to another. It can be used for crossing over. It's like a portal. We're aiming for the real marsh woods now. Rare fungi in there. Valuable but hard to harvest. Frogs and wrens jangle their voices safely among reeds. Otherwise, the air is creeping quiet. But a glimmer scene is quite fragile. Extreme care will be required to fit whole humans through. So therein lies your hope. Whatever the Thrixor are doing with your people, shepherding them all to the Terrafract? I can only guess, but it's likely slow, slow work. The trees pack wetly in. The stink of putrefied plant matter furrows thick in noses, summoning snot. Puddles of mucus-like muck among the roots blog and quiver. Wouldn't mistake that for a fox den. A rotted hole at the base of a tree twists into fetid darkness. Mothman said there were a couple ways down. Right. Well, Tilly and I maybe could do well to find another entrance, right? A wider net can catch more lives. No qualms about the team, I guess. Yeah, let's get more survivors. I'm willing to take this chance. Lavinia and Tilly pick a squelchly path, trying to keep their steps on spongy old wood and the truest stones. They soon discover a slick stairwell into the overgrown foundation of some forgotten structure. Hoot hoot! Hearing Lavinia's signal, both parties begin their descent, feeling along close, gunky walls, ducking through wet curtains of lacy mold to whatever is waiting below. Oh, nifty. We got some buffs. We got a hell... Oh, man, they have those stupid... Oh, God, that's sick. 
There are a lot of them. So let's just start taking them apart. No idea why you. Can I wild grasp him to keep him from moving? I can. Pin for one turn. I probably didn't need to do that, but you never know, I might miss. Yeah, untouchable. Okay, yeah, we don't want to... That's Flare, that's Wild Grass, that's Wild Grass. I don't need to do that. I'm just gonna shoot him. Is that? Yeah, here they come. Here they come. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Oh god, there's a so freaking many of these. Okay. Well, first of all, one less to worry about. Second of all, yeah, you want some? Come get some. Damn it, he dodged. Okay, second of all, we're gonna come here. I'm gonna interfuse with this fire. Come on! There you go. Just gotta form a line of archers and we'll take these guys down. Ooh, thank god I have armor. Oh, man. That thing shreds on. These guys are shredding my armor. The hell was that? Get good old discus with the damage. And girl pal will keep moving. What is that? Bone Lance is really good right about now. What are they doing? They're like intimidating me? I don't understand. Oh, he just teleported. That sucks. Buddy, teleported right into my trap! Yeah! Yeah, unbreakable means that he... Dang it, he put me in stasis. Kill all enemies. I summon the rocks of plenty. In case you want to come closer, and you go to hell. Uh, let's move over here first. Okay. I'll open that. Ow. Oh, it's like a stun check or something. No. 
Okay. L Augur is in big trouble. Tilly, can you get there? Tilly cannot get there. So let's move here first. Let me see if I can... I... I cannot because I'm... I have no choice. Augur has to... Nope. I'll take this fire. And just move it closer. Because that's all I can do. There you go. That everybody? Who else wants some? Come on! I got a one-handed axe, which I will replace with that because it's much better. What do you have? You have archery, which is enemy attacks with a hunter, they will retaliate. Plus 30 do- hell yes! Familiar faces float through the shadows where they hid their chains, grimly hollowed eye, they stared. But they are whiskey ham folk. And they are alive. We came as quick as we could. Can't help but feel sorry, though. Tilly addresses them. We cut through your captors. The exit's clear. Can you walk, or do you need assistance? Searching out human faces, they find just 42 of the lost. But they're survivors. They clamor from the nests of rotting vegetation that have been presumably been provided for them. Ah, uh, Lavidia, you're... Here you are. Found some more? No one go too far too quick, it's still the swamp. It'll take days of warm coaxing to crack the cold trauma that's frozen their faces grim. But it's a brave start. That's pretty good, man. Hey, 42 is really good because I think we started the chapter with 30 odd possible. You'll be okay, Elsie. Your parents will be glad to see you. Oh, I wonder if she'll grow up and join us now. I'm just worried about my big sister. She, I think that she died. Your sister's a Luna, right? She and I had classes. The campaign's name is Aluna and the Moth. Hmm, that's her. They took her away like the others, but she never took her up the tunnel. No, it. There was a. It was like a door made out of spider string. It was like a. They wove it, kind of. In the air, it appeared, and it went away somewhere else. I don't know where, but they took people through. One by one, they... Everyone seemed to want to go. Sounds like the Grim scene, like what the Mothman said. I think that's what it must have been. They called it the door, Aluna and the older kids. People would go through, and they'd come back once time had passed, and except... They'd look like monsters then, and they wouldn't talk. Doesn't seem to be much left. Not on the outside, not on the inside. Just a violent misery. Um, but Aluna was the last one taken. She's been gone a lot longer than the others and never came back. So anyway, I'm pretty sure she died. I mean, I hope she didn't. But then I also think it might be better if she did. Because she wouldn't want... Shh, I understand. My mom didn't suffer long. I'm glad for that much. Mm, yeah. They reach the edge of the wood marsh. The musical yips of a wild fox greet them, echoing the wood. Milk gold sunshine coats the world. It smells so good all of a sudden, doesn't it? I should also, I mean, she'd ask me to say, thank you. We tried to escape, me and Luna. We did try, but they caught us. Thank you for coming to get me. You proved my sister right. They trek towards home. Later searches only stir the bones. If something called a glimmer scene exists here, it seems beyond human access. No sign of the girl's sister appears. Oh, I needed even more to get to, but I got legacy points, one health to the company, and one potency to the company. So that's pretty good, I'd say. Yeah, years of peace. Years of peace. 
Oh, that's it. You don't really undermine victories that much on the higher difficulties, huh? During the years of peace, seasons passed slow in the town of Whiskeyham. Hurtful reminders were everywhere. Empty homes, graves for missing bodies, classrooms full of ghosts. But human resilience is remarkable. Our great gift was smiling at the simple heat of sunlight. We'll bless whatever's left to count. Lavidia carried one large bedroll upon her back, throwed in a jug of wine on his, and they snuck off to the hills for some time to enjoy the views and each other's company. Sometimes I worried that once times were peaceful, we wouldn't have anything left to talk about. We could always gossip about Morvov. Thodian noticed that the library at Drum Stable had fallen to disrepair during all the conflict. So he passed a summer helping to rebuild it. Pix went back to the place he grew up and was tempted by old acquaintances to remain there. But in the end, the past proved an unwise place to linger. Argo tried to take Pix shopping at the local outfitters. Plus, they give the Club of the Deadly Plenty a great discount. But I like the clothes I have. How many days straight have you worn that thing? Hey, I wash it! The town rarely slept before midnight. They told me I should check on you. I said you were fine. Teeth punched out of a smile. Homes that won't ever light up again. Lavidia, it's awful. It is. I won't ever not remember them. Starlight mirrored lamplight and the vigil seldom slacked. Yeah! Here we go. Okay, so you... Oh, damn it! So humble getting just the tier zero. I'm an idiot. That really makes me... I don't have a lot of... Oh, no, wait. I don't have a lot of, uh, so I'm only gonna tier one you. Oh, you really do have to find your gear in this heavier thing, because I'm not getting lots of time to... Okay, so she would like a wand. Would I like this wand or this wand? I have never usually used these, so I'll use this wand. Make sure that everyone's got... Yeah, some of these people have tier... Zero stuff. So we need to... He's already got fire, so let's give you leaf. Because I like that. Can't get to tier two, can't get to tier two, can't get to tier two, can't get to tier two. I can get to tier two on this bow, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that just because it's useful. Even though I already did it, it doesn't hurt to... That should improve damage and durability on the company a little. There's wisdom that survives from grandmother times. Never trust a dream, you dream in moonlight. Take care if you lie under the windows cast. Even gaps as slender as moonbeams will admit a skilled weaver's needle. Snore. It's black in here. In the dark between book and shelf. But oh. Truly a moon. You don't seem real. Ah! He's up. I'm only saying so. Bet I'm out on the ocean behind the bookcase. What the hell? Pick's going to want to stay dry, but if I slip into that water where I wash to the depths, where I grow paper fins and swim eternity's legends alone. Okay, this is you having a dream and nothing makes sense. Oh hey! There's there's someone out jumping on the waves. Watch out, that's danger The figure falls through a hole in the shifting waters. That's dangerous, I tried to say. Am I the only one who can do something? The sheep certainly won't help. What? So Lavidia hops over the woolly misted sea to the hole, drips limb by limb into darkness. And now she's inside a shadowy cell where odorless lamps emit little more than haze. Who, who are you? I'm who's having the dream. Is that Lavidia? Lavidia Grip? Lavidia suddenly recognizes you. It is, it's a Luna Arkwright. How vivid this seems. It's like I'm seeing you again. You are? How'd you get here? Do they know? Well, you're in my dream. 
dream. You keep saying you're dreaming. If you're not one of their tricks, if you're really Lavidia Grip, maybe you got here through dreaming? Do you know what happened to my little sister? Elsie? She, we found her. She's safe. She's safe. Right. Basically. This feels too real. Where are we meant to be? Somewhere else. Those bug things brought me through the... Their world and ours, there's... This won't make sense, but it's like a... From beyond a dim door, a drone enters the room. Distant light glows. Trouble? The noise vibrates in every unfirmed stone. Lavidia, if you can leave here, you need to do it. They're going to find you, and I don't know if... How do we save you? We'll come and get you out. Actually, I... What we need is to find another one of those glimmer scenes, right? They'll sense a threat and you won't ever get close. My sister's strong. Tell her I... Uh, can you be sure they detect us? Well, I... The longer I've been here, the more it seemed they have some other perception. A sense attuned to the forces inside things. Their essences, or whatever you call it. A group of you would be like thunder to them. You'd be throwing your lives away for a person who's been gone so long, she... I... I can barely remember Elsie's face. I'll come alone, then. Badass. The dream begins to fade. Lavidia wakes from her wandering sleep. She holds a clear idea in her mind, like a kernel of light that can draw her over the hills to where she must go. Several days pass before she's missed. Her trail is easy enough to follow. Her note wasn't chasing a dream of a girl who's been missing for how long? Her obsession with the truth inspires me, but it scares me, too. I don't know, but it feels a little like four years ago. Oh, she's gone! Oh, she is gone! Make sure that there's no other places to- Thank God I have- Let's go recruit a person and start clearing this stuff out, because, yeah, we're gonna need to. We are going to need to, ladies and gentlemen. That is it for this chapter. Welcome to chapter three, where we're missing a mage.